What up, guys? Scrubbage here with another Raid Shadow Legends video. It is that time again. The tower is alight, and this is probably my most reluctant shard pull. I really, really didn't want to. I want to get the champion. There's an awesome 10x over here. <sighs> Videos, people enjoy them. <laughs> I'm doing them for people. People enjoy them. I like doing it, not gonna lie. So let's get on. Let's slug on. We got 58 ancients. We got 24 voids. And we're just going to do two sacred. Because that's what we need to get the barrel. The XP barrel and all our shards and everything else. So here we go. First 10 out the pipe. Hopefully we get something delicious. Otherwise, oopsie daisy. Don't expect much, obviously. Lady Quillen put out a guide on her. Not a bad champ. Fan cleric. Helpful. Can be pretty helpful. Faction Wars champ, which I hate saying about pretty much anyone because it just feels like a cop out. But he's a Faction War champ. There's a nice tax session. Probably going to get mostly tax sessions. I'm nowhere near on the mercy for any of this stuff, so probably the closest on Void. But I mean, that doesn't really mean much. Old Hermit York, really cool champion, especially if you're uh, free to play and you need a reviver, a cult brawler, great. Uh, Clan boss and then Oathbound actually is a pretty decent control. All right, here we go. Karam, they just did some updates on him. I'm some bouncing. Hopefully he's a little bit better, but I'm not expecting much. Next set here. Rockbreaker can solo Faction Wars 21 if you build them right. It's a tough one to do to get that build done right, but you can do it. All right, here we go. This eight solos. <sighs> Grinner. That was just a great name. You know, just sometimes you nail it. Hell Freak. Okay. Simple. Clean. I get it. Siege Breaker. And a guy who really looks defensive. But I mean, maybe it's offensive armor. What do I know? <sighs> Man, she's annoying when you're first trying to get through the level that ally attack she has just wrecks you brute bane i've actually seen to use pretty well some people have used him pretty well to get through some levels uh hopefully we don't go all solo at least throw an epic in there come on color it up man coordinator oh no yep no tax all the way through felt it coming knew it was coming but hey what are you gonna do here we go not attack session? I mean, I want the 10x bad. She's super cool champion. Siler's actually really, really good as well. Uh, good speed and control and all that kind of wonderful stuff. Paragon. A lot of people use the Paragon cheese. They worked on the twins, but from what I hear, they're pretty much changing that. They put a patch in to fix it. So you can't just Paragon cheese. The highest levels of the twins. Which I'm kind of okay with, I guess. Because... They just released it and people are already cheesing the heck out of it. <laughs> so it's just kind of, all right. Ursala, the Mourners, amazing. Battle Sage, not too bad. All right. The Mourners started that kind of trend of having these revivers um, that would do their revive even if someone wasn't dead. Like they had like, you know, add strength in there or whatever, which is not cool sometimes. Like before the, the auto control and all that stuff, man, and... You put it on auto, you walk away, and they, if they just held on to the revive a second longer. All right, final final void here. Pretty underwhelming shard opening, as you would expect. Here we go. I'm not buying any. I want to, sure, get that champion. Like, she's really, really cool, but I am not buying any. Just not happening. All right, here we go. We got two of these guys. His stock went up recently. He's pretty good champ. All right, here we go. Something. A little bit of gold to end it with. I might do a third. Yeah. Deacon Armstrong. You know what? That's actually a good place to end it. I got what I wanted, I believe. So let's just check that out. We'll crack one more if I don't have it. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. I have jalapeno in my eye. So I have... It's worth it. Legendary book. I will crack one more. 
If you stuck around, hooray, you can see me crack one more. I get a book. I fill up my thing. And maybe a legendary? No! Actually, a chuck is pretty good. Uh, I'm saying it as horribly as I can because I don't want to say the pronunciation that could uh, lead to other things. Anyways, thank you so much for staying the extra teeny bit there. You have yourself a wonderful weekend if you do pull, which I caution against. Hopefully you hit big, you hit gold, you get the wins. Let me know in the comments below if someone does better than I did, which would not be hard to do. Anyways, I am out and you have a wonderful day.